Once upon a time, there was a wise Zen master who lived in a small village. He was known for his profound wisdom and his ability to teach his students the art of mindfulness. One day, a young man came to him seeking guidance. Master, the young man said, I am troubled by the constant chatter in my mind. I cannot seem to find peace. What can I do? The Zen master smiled and said, The wisdom of silence is the key to mindfulness. Sit with me and I will show you. The young man sat down beside the master, and they both closed their eyes. For several minutes there was nothing but silence. The young man began to feel uneasy, wondering when the master would speak. As the young man strained his ears, he could hear nothing but the sound of his own breathing. He shook his head, indicating that he could not hear anything. The master smiled and said, That is the sound of silence. It is always there, but we rarely take the time to listen to it. It is in this silence that we can find peace and clarity. Finally, the master opened his eyes and said, Do you hear that? The young man listened intently, but he heard nothing. That is the sound of silence, the master said. It is always there, waiting for us to listen. When we quiet our minds, we can hear the wisdom of the universe. The young man was amazed by the master's words. He realized that he had been so caught up in his own thoughts that he had forgotten to listen to the world around him. From that day forward, the young man practiced the art of mindfulness. He learned to quiet his mind and listen to the wisdom of silence. He found peace and contentment in the present moment, and he knew that he had the master to thank for his newfound wisdom. As he continued to practice mindfulness, the young man began to notice a change in his relationships with others. He became more patient and understanding, and he was able to communicate more effectively. He realized that by being fully present in each moment, he was able to connect with others on a deeper level. This newfound awareness brought him a sense of joy and fulfillment that he had never experienced before. Years later, the young man became a Zen master himself. He passed on the teachings of his own master to his students, and he always emphasized the importance of silence and mindfulness. And so the wisdom of silence continued to be passed down from generation to generation, reminding us to listen to the world around us and find peace in the present moment.